Hey guys, welcome back to Shade Review. In today's video, we are reviewing the Persil 3166 Calligrapher Edition sunglasses. So first off, let's go ahead and pop the sunglasses on face and talk about the dimensions. These sunglasses have 51 millimeter lenses and a 22 millimeter bridge. And I really like the styling of these frames. They have these absolutely gorgeous acetate fronts paired with these really nice metal stems and a single metal bridge. And I think that really adds a lot of depth and character to the these frames. Of course, like every pair of personal sunglasses, they have the personal supreme arrow here in the top right corners of the sunglasses. Now taking a closer look at the top bridge, we can see a little bit of etching here on the bridge, which definitely adds a lot of character to these frames. And then moving down to the temples, again, we can see some beautiful etching here on the metal temples. Now moving down, we can see that the ear rests are the exact same material as the fronts. Here we can see this absolutely beautiful brown horn material on the ear rest that perfectly match the front of the sunglasses. These sunglasses do have fully adjustable nose rests and etched through the nose rest, we can see a little purse logo there for authentication purposes. Now taking a look at the top metal bridge of sunglasses, we can see they say 5122. And of course it stands for the lens size and the bridge width of the sunglasses. Of course these sunglasses are made in Italy and they're gonna say that here in the inner right temple sunglasses, they just say personal handmade in Italy, which is really nice to see. The sunglasses of course also have all metal hinges and they feel very good when open up and when closing them. The right one feels a little bit looser than the left, but both of them still do feel really good. And these are three barrel all metal hinges. Now on the outside right ear rest, we can see a little etched purse logo there for authentication purposes. And that is not gonna be found here on the left side, only on the right. These sunglasses actually do have a version of Purcell's Meflecto stem system right here built into the temples. It's not going to be quite as good as their normal Meflecto stem system because it is all metal and there's no acetate here. But these frames are definitely going to bend out at the Meflecto stem system point, which is going to allow the sunglasses to give a custom fit to basically anyone's face, which is really nice. And that makes wearing sunglasses extremely comfortable. Now, as far as styling goes, like I said, I really do like the styling of these sunglasses. They have classic round shaped lenses, and I think they look really good with the acetate here mixed with the metal, which adds a really cool combination to these frames. These frames definitely look very classy and very nice. Now, unfortunately, because they do have these round lenses, they're not going to have the best coverage from the sun. So here up top, we can see there's definitely a very big gap to sunlight in unprotected. And then here on the sides, again, there's a really big gap to sunlight in unprotected. So unfortunately, we're not going to have very good coverage from the sun with these sunglasses. So it's not going to make them extremely practical. Now, when you buy a pair of calligrapher edition personal sunglasses, they actually come in their very own unique box, which is pretty cool. And not only do they come in their own unique box, they also come with a different color little hard shell case here. So we can see it is a black case versus the brown that is traditionally sold with personal sunglasses. So that is definitely a cool little addition as well. It also comes with a little booklet here that has more information about the personal calligrapher edition series sunglasses. Overall, I think it's a very cool addition of personal sunglasses. I really do like the styling. They do remind me of a pair of Ray-Bans that look similar to this. I can't exactly remember the exact uh, reference number of these, but I definitely think that personal sunglasses are better than Ray-Ban. The build quality is definitely just better overall and the acetate material and all the etching and all the work with Pearl sunglasses are definitely better as well. So I definitely recommend picking these up versus that pair of Ray-Ban sunglasses. Now, as far as pricing goes, these sunglasses are going to cost you around $350, I believe. However, you can find these much cheaper on Amazon. So I'm going to leave a link in the description down below directly to Amazon where you can check these sunglasses out on there. Well, that's all good for you guys in this video. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to give me a big thumbs up below and of course make sure to subscribe button and then you'll be notified every single time I upload a brand new video just like this one to my YouTube channel. Again thank you all so much for watching and I'll catch you all in the next one.